Salem. Uh, the name here is Dennis, uh, call sign Kilo Delta 9, Lima Victor Romeo. And I uh, wanted to show you my inverted L antenna setup and see if maybe you had some suggestions or if maybe you could do a video doing um, some plots on it with uh, MMA and, a and uh, see what it looks like. But uh, anyhow, the uh, feed point here is near the bottom of the tree. I got some direct burial coax. I'm uh, using a center insulator, so this is the ground side. This wire here goes down here to this uh, bracket where I've got the uh, the ground radials going off in uh, various directions. I got about 19 of those, and then this wire here I got going to this uh, eight foot ground rod that I got driven about uh, seven feet into the ground. And then for the uh, the radiating elements is uh, this wire here, which goes up into the tree about oh, about 25 feet or so up into the uh, up into the air, and then um, I'll just have to walk out front here. I got it going through the trees out to the uh, the front yard here to this. Uh, Nine foot um, uh, extendable painter's pole, and then I got a looping back to the tree where I started. Um, tell you the truth, I'm not quite sure of the total length of this wire. Um, well, let's see here. I gotta think. Um, the part that I added on that loops back towards the tree that's over 80 feet. So just doing uh, an estimate, let's just say I got about 160 feet of wire that I'm using for this antenna. Um, like I said, I really didn't measure it out, I was kind of <laughs> throwing wire up into 